Are you a freelancer, startupper or digital nomad? You should know about what coworking really is. You are listening to Coworking Jungle, a podcast hosted by Claudia, Mateusz and David. Three explorers coming from Sainte Poland and sent to Italy by program Erasmus+. Plus. We will explore the Milepian co-working space in Rome to discover and explain through stories and real experiences the real value of co-working culture. So today we are here with... Uh, Fabio Camilli. Okay, nice to meet you. So nice to meet you. Can you tell a little uh, bit about yourself? Yeah, um, I uh, start to work in communication as a graphic designer, but after a few years I saw that the big market was into the coding environment, so like more uh, into web designer developing uh, things like that. So I moved to coding and um, I've been working for the last uh, 15 years Uh, for a company in UK, uh, basically we uh, build uh, application for university, like uh, community, like engaging community application, similar to Facebook, but is an intranet application. So it's just uh, for um, uh, student or alumni community within the university. In, in the last few years, we start to um, move to other sectors. So from education, we move to uh, the corporate enterprise as well. Um, so we try to get like a big, bigger uh, piece of the market, you know. And we work pretty much for, uh, with the most uh, well-known uh, UK university. Um, so Cambridge, Oxford, uh, UCL, uh, London College of Communication, and so on. Uh, but the last, uh, let's say, five, six years, we start to get into other markets as well, like American market. We got like few university in Japan, a uh, few clients, uh, corporate in Canada. So we expanding very, very fast, basically. Nice. Yeah. For how long have you been doing in the Milepiani community? In the Milepiani, I think I'm one of the first one actually over here. Mm-hmm. So I started like uh, approx, uh, I believe around seven years ago, six, seven years ago. And um, obviously I'm a full employee mm-hmm. with my company in UK, but um, after I've been working for, uh, I've been working remotely for 10 years for them. So after I was working at home for a few years, I decided to move on because, you know, it's not easy like jumping with the pajamas from the bed to the desk. And you feel like you never stop to work. Basically, you don't have like hours and time. So and so it's better to commute in the, in, to the work in the morning, have like a shower and Obviously, you, you come to an environment that is like different people and you can socialize, you can make different, uh, engage with different sectors as well because everybody here, everybody here, Mille Piani, do all different things. There is like uh, uh, video production, uh, there is like uh, uh, movie production, there is illustrator, uh, graphic designer, uh, developers, a bit of everything. So it's good. And how did you find out about Mili Piani? I don't remember. I think uh, um, I, I, I searched on the net for co-working, but mm-hmm. at that time it was not so common in Rome. But I was coming from, uh, um, I was living two years in Australia, in Sydney, and over there it was kind of common to go to work in the, to, to rent a desk within an office, you know. Mm-hmm. But in Rome, it uh, was not that common. So it was very few, and most of them, they were extremely expensive. And also, they were uh, based in an in apartment. So you go like small rooms, every room is like three, four people. And if you leave your apartment to go to another apartment, uh, you don't feel like you actually go into the office environment. Over here, I like because it's like uh, more like a where London warehouse is like open space, uh, like industrial type of uh, building. So um, I visit this place and uh, I fall in love straight away. Oh. Do you have any hope to 
little bit outside work? Uh, yes, I do. I do a bit of everything. I do a bit of skating. I uh, riding a motorcycle. I I swim. Uh, I do a bit of everything. So Basically, like I run as well. The motorcycle. Yeah, sometimes if it's nice weather, yeah. <laughs> if it's raining, I prefer going to the car. Yeah. So, uh, as you know, I'm from Poland, so I have, I'm curious if you know something about Poland. Yes, I know something about Poland because I used to live in London for 10 years and there is a lot of uh, Polish people yes. over there. So, I used to work uh, when I was studying in England and uh, while I was studying, I was even like working in bars and like waitress and things like that. And I met so many Polish people, I used to live with them as well. So, I mean, I never been to Poland, but I managed to get in touch with this culture. And uh, I think uh, we get really well together. Like Italian and Polish, they're pretty similar in terms of uh, culture, you know? Yes. So, thank you so much for this episode. And thank you, uh, our guests, for listening. And see you in the next episode. Okay, thank you very much. Good luck. <laughs>